Blessed is our God, always now and ever unto the ages of ages. Amen. Glory to thee, our God. Glory to thee, O heavenly King, Comforter, Spirit of Truth, Lord everywhere present, and fill us all things, treasury of good things, and giver of life. Come and dwell in us, and cleanse us of all impurity, and save our souls, O good one. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy in us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy in us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy in us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. O most holy Trinity, have mercy on us. O Lord, blot out our sins. O Master, pardon our iniquities. O Holy One, visit and heal our infirmities for thy name's sake. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Our Father, who art in the heavens, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our debts, as we forgive our debtors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from the evil one. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Lord, have mercy, 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 Lord, have mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. O come, let us worship God, our King. O come, let us worship and fall down before Christ, our King and God. O come, let us worship and fall down before Christ Himself, our King and God. How beloved are thy dwellings, O Lord of hosts. My soul longeth and fainteth for the courts of the Lord. My heart and my flesh have rejoiced in the living God. Where this fair hath found herself a house, and the turtle dove and nest for herself, where she may lay her young. Even thine altars, O Lord of hosts, my King and my God. Blessed are they that dwell in thy house unto ages of ages. Shall they praise thee? Blessed is the man who sells us from thee. He hath made a sense in his heart, and the veils weeping in the place which he hath appointed. Yea, for the lawgiver will give blessings. They shall go from strength to strength. The God of gods shall be seen in Sion. O Lord of hosts, hearken unto my prayer. Give ear, O God of Jacob. O God, our defender, behold, and look upon the face of thine anointed one. For better is one day in thy courts and thousands elsewhere. I have chosen rather to be an outcast in the house of my God than to dwell in the tents of sinners. For the Lord loveth mercy and truth. God will give grace and glory. The Lord will not withhold good things from them that walk in innocence. O Lord God of hosts, blessed is the man that hopeth in thee. Thou hast been gracious, O Lord, unto thy land. Thou hast turned back the captivity of Jacob. Thou hast forgiven the iniquities of thy people. Thou hast covered all their sins. Thou hast made all thy wrath to cease, thou hast turned back from the wrath of thine anger. Turn us back, O God, of our salvation, and turn away thine anger from us. Wilt thou be wroth with us unto the ages, or wilt thou draw thy wrath from generation to generation? O God, thou turn and quicken us, and thy people shall be glad in thee. Show us, O Lord, thy mercy and thy salvation, do thou give unto us. I will hear what the Lord God will speak in me, for he will speak peace to his people and to his saints, and to them that turn their heart unto him. Surely not unto them that fear him is a salvation, that glory may dwell in our land. Mercy and truth are met together, righteousness and peace have kissed each other. Truth has sprung out of the earth, and righteousness hath looked down from heaven. Yea, for the Lord will give goodness, and our land shall yield her fruit. Righteousness shall go before him, and shall set his footsteps in the way. Bow down thine ear, O Lord, and hearken unto me, for poor and needy am I. Reserve my soul, for I am holy. Save thy servant, O my God, that hopeth in thee. Have mercy on me, O Lord, for unto thee will I cry all the day long. Make glad the soul of thy servant, for unto thee have I lifted up my soul. For thou, O Lord, art good and gentle, and plenteous in mercy unto all them that call upon thee. Give ear, O Lord, unto my prayer, and attend unto the voice of my supplication. In the day of mine affliction have I cried unto thee, for thou hast heard me. There is none like unto thee among the gods, O Lord, nor are there any works like unto thy works. 
All the nations and gods made shall come and shall worship before thee, O Lord, and shall glorify thy name. For thou art great and workest wonders, thou alone art God. Guide me, O Lord, in thy way, and I will walk in thy truth. Let my heart rejoice that I may fear thy name. I will confess thee, O Lord, my God, with all my heart, and I will glorify thy name forever. For great is thy mercy upon me, and thou hast delivered my soul from the nethermost Hades. O God, transgressors have risen up against me, and the assembly of the mighty have sought after my soul, and they have not set thee before them. But thou, O Lord, my God, art compassionate and merciful, long-suffering, and plenteous in mercy and truth. Look upon me, have mercy upon me, give thy strength unto thy servant, and save the son of thy handmaiden. Work in me a sign unto good, and let them that hate me behold and be put to shame. For thou, O Lord, hast helped me and comforted me. Work in me a sign unto good, and let them that hate me behold and be put to shame. For thou, O Lord, hast helped me and comforted me. <coughs> Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. Glory to thee, O God. Alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. Glory to thee, O God. Alleluia, 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 glory to thee, O God. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. In thee, O Father, that which is fashioned according to the image of God was manifestly preserved. For having taken up thy cross, thou didst follow Christ, and by thine example didst teach that the flesh is to be disdained as fleeting, but that the soul must be cared for as a thing immortal. Wherefore thy spirit rejoice of the angels, O venerable Patapius, both now and ever and unto the ages of ages. Amen. O thou who for our sake was born of a virgin, and didst suffer crucifixion, O good one, and didst despoil death by death, and this God didst trivial the resurrection, disdain of them which thou hast fashioned with thy hand, show forth thy love for mankind, a merciful one, except the failed folk, O who gave thee birth, and interceded for us, and do thou our Savior, save the despairing people. Deliver us not up utterly for thy holy name's sake. Neither didst know thou thy covenant, and cause not thy mercy to depart from us. For Abraham's sake thy beloved, and for Isaac's sake thy servant, and for Israel's thy holy one. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy in us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy in us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy in us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. O most holy Trinity, have mercy in us. O Lord, blot out our sins. O Master, pardon our iniquities. O Holy One, visit and heal our infirmities for thy name's sake. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Our Father, who art in the heavens, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our debts as we forgive our debtors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from the evil one. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. Those who have found thy temple to be a to be a place of spiritual healing, O Holy One, and have recourse thereto with zeal, ask to receive the healing of their infirmities and forgiveness of their transgressions they committed in their lives. For thou art seen to be an intercessor for all in need of venerable Patapius. Lord have mercy, 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 Lord have mercy. Lord have mercy, 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 Lord have mercy. Thou who at all times and at every hour in heaven and on earth art worshipped and glorified, O Christ God, who art long suffering, plenteous in mercy, most compassionate, who lovest the righteousness, mercy on sinners, who followest all to salvation through the promise of good things to come. Receive, O Lord, our prayers at this hour and guide our life toward thy commandments. <laughs> Sanctify our souls, make chaste our bodies, correct our thoughts, purify our intentions, and deliver us from every sorrow, evil, and pain. 
Accomplice us above thy holy angels, that guarded and guided by their array, we may attain to the unity of the faith and the knowledge of thine unapproachable glory. <coughs> For blessed art thou unto the ages of ages. Amen. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now, never, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. More honorable than the cherubim, and beyond compare, more glorious than the seraphim. Do about corruption, give us birth to God the Word, the very Theotokos, thee do we magnify. In the name of the Lord, Father, bless. God be gracious unto us, and bless us, and cause thy face to shine upon us, and have mercy on us. Amen. O Master, Lord Jesus Christ, our God, who art long suffering in the face of our transgressions, and who has brought us even unto this present hour, wherein thou didst hang upon the life giving tree, and didst to make a way into paradise for the wise thief, and by death didst destroy death. Be gracious unto us sinners and thine unworthy servants, for we have sinned and committed iniquity, and are not worthy to lift up our eyes and behold the height of heaven. For we have abandoned the way of thy righteousness, and have often the desires of our hearts. But we beseech thy boundless goodness. Spare us, O Lord, according to the multitude of thy mercy, and save us for thy holy name's sake, where days are consumed in vanity. Rescue us from the hand of the adversary, and forgive us our sins, and mortify our carnal mind, that putting aside the old man we may be clad in the new, and live for the air master and benefactor, and that thus by following in thy commandments we may attain to rest everlasting, wherein is the dwelling place of all them that rejoice. For thou art indeed the true joy and gladness of them that love thee, O Christ our God, and unto thee we send of glory, thy unoriginate Father, and thy most holy and good and life-creating Spirit, now, never, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Blessed is our God, who is now and ever in the age of ages. Amen. O come, let us worship God our King. O come, let us worship and fall down before Christ our King and God. O come, let us worship and fall down before Christ himself, our King and God. <coughs> Bless the Lord, O my soul. O Lord, my God, thou hast been magnified exceedingly. Confession and majesty hast thou put on. Who coverest thyself with light as with a garment, who stretches out the heaven as it were a curtain, who supporteth his chambers in the waters, who appointeth the clouds for his ascent, who walketh upon the wings of the winds, who maketh his angels spirits and his ministers a flame of fire, who establisheth the earth in the sureness thereof, it shall not be turned back forever and ever. The abyss like a garment is his mantle, upon the mountain shall the waters stand. At thy rebuke they will flee, at the voice of thy thunder shall they be afraid. The mountains rise up, and the plains sink down unto the place where thou hast established them. <clears throat> thou appointest to them that they shall not pass, neither return to cover the earth. He sendeth forth springs in the valleys, between the mountains will the waters run. They shall give drink to all the beasts of the field, the wild asses will wait to quench their thirst. Beside them will the birds of the heaven lodge, from the midst of the rocks will they give voice. He watereth the mountains from his chambers, the earth shall be satisfied with the fruit of thy works. He causeth the grass to grow for the cattle, and green herb for the service of men, to bring forth bread out of the earth, and wine maketh glad the heart of man, to make his face cheerful with oil, and bread strengtheneth man's heart. The trees of the plain shall be satisfied, the cedars of Lebanon which thou hast planted, there will the sparrows make their nests, the house of the heron is chief among them. The high mountains are a refuge for the hearts, and so is the rock for the hares. He hath made the moon for seasons, the sun knoweth his going down. Thou appointest the darkness, and there was the night, wherein all the beasts of the forest will go abroad. Young lions roaring after their prey, and seeking their food from God. The sun ariseth, and they are gathered together, and they lay them down in their dens. But man shall go forth unto his work, and to his labor, and to the evening. How magnified are thy works, O Lord! In wisdom hast thou made them all. The earth is filled with thy creation. So is this great and spacious sea. Therein are things creeping innumerable, small living creatures with the great. There go the ships, there this dragon, whom thou hast made to play therein. All things wait on thee to give them their food in due season. When thou givest it them, they will gather it. When thou openest thy hand, all things shall be filled with goodness. When thou turnest away thy face, they shall be troubled. Thou wilt take their spirit, and they shall cease, and unto their dust shall they return. 
Thou wilt send forth thy spirit, and they shall be created, and thou shalt renew the face of the earth. Let the glory of the Lord be unto the ages. The Lord will rejoice in his works. Who looketh on the earth, and maketh it tremble. Who toucheth the mountains, and they smoke. I will sing unto the Lord throughout my life. I will chant to my God for as long as I have my being. May my words be sweet unto him, and I will rejoice in the Lord. O that sinners would cease from the earth, and they that work iniquity, that they should be no more. Bless the Lord, O my soul. The sun knoweth his going down. Thou appointest the darkness, and there was the night. How magnified are thy works, O Lord. In wisdom hast thou made them all. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Alleluia, 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 glory to thee, O God. Alleluia, 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 glory to thee, O God. Alleluia, 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 glory to thee, O God. In peace, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. For the peace from above and the salvation of our souls, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. For the peace of the whole world, the good estate of the holy churches of God, and the union of all, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. For this holy temple, and for them that with faith, reverence, and the fear of God, and to herein, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. For our great Lord and Father, His Holiness, Patriarch, Kirill, for our Lord, the very most reverend, much fault, and Alari, and first Sayarch of the Russian Church abroad, for the venerable priesthood, the diaconate in Christ, for all the clergy and people, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. For our all venerable Father, the abbot of this holy monastery, our committed serve him and all his brethren in Christ, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. For this land, its authorities, and armed forces, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. For the God preserve Russian land and its Orthodox people, both in the homeland and in the diaspora, and for their salvation, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. For this holy monastery, for every city and country in the faithful that dwell therein, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. For a seasonable weather, abundance of the fruits of the earth, and peaceful times, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. For travelers by sea, land, and air, for the sick, the suffering, the imprisoned, and for their salvation, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. That we may be delivered from all tribulation, wrath, and necessity, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. Help us, save us, have mercy on us, and keep us, O God, by thy grace. Lord, have mercy. Calling to remembrance our most holy, most pure, most blessed, glorious Lady, the Altocos, and ever Virgin Mary, with all the saints, let us commit ourselves and one another in all our life unto Christ our God. To thee, to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. In the fourth tone, Lord, I have cried unto thee, hearken unto me, hearken unto me, behold. Lord, I have cried unto thee, hearken unto me, Attempt to the voice of my supplication when I cry unto thee, hearken unto me, O Lord. Let my prayer be set forth as incense before thee, the lifting up of my hands as an evening sacrifice, hearken unto thee, O Lord. Before my mouth and a door of enclosure round about my lips, 
Incline not my heart into words of evil to make excuse with excuses and sins with none that work iniquity, and I will not join with their chosen. The righteous man will chasten me with mercy and reprove me. As for the oil of the sinner, let it not anoint my head. For yet more is my prayer in the presence of their pleasure, swallowed as near by the rock of their judges then. They shall hear my words, for they be sweetened. As their plot of earth is broken upon the earth, so as their bones and scattered die into Hades. For unto thee, O Lord, O Lord, are mine eyes, and thee of I hope, take not my soul away. Keep me from the snare which they have laid for me, and from the stumbling blocks of them that work iniquity. The sinners shall fall into their own nets. I am alone until I pass by. With my voice unto the Lord have I cried, with my voice unto the Lord have I made supplication. I will pour out before him my supplication, my affliction before him will I declare. When my spirit was fainting within me, then thou doest my past. In this way wherein I have walked, they hid for me a snare. I looked upon my right hand and beheld, and there was none that did know me. Light has failed me, and there was none that watched the top for my soul. I cried unto thee, O Lord, I said, Thou art my hope, my portion art thou in the land of the living. Attend unto my supplication, for I am brought very low. Deliver me from them that persecute me, for they are stronger than I. Bring my soul out of prison, that I may confess thy name. The righteous shall wait patiently for me, until thou shalt reward me. Out of the depths of I cried unto thee, O Lord, O Lord, hear my voice. Let thine ears be attentive to the voice of my supplication. If thou shouldest mark iniquities, O Lord, O Lord, who shall stand? For with thee there is forgiveness, though there be woman who in manner past food. There it has proved her who will give birth to God in the flesh. Is made radiant with joy and dancing, <coughs> rejoicing and crying aloud. Let all the tribes of Israel rejoice with me, for though I have conceived in my womb and put away the disgrace of barrenness, for thus hath the Creator been well pleased, and hearkening unto my prayer in those things which I have desired. He hath healed the pain of my heart. <coughs> if thou shouldst mark iniquity, for thy name's sake have I patiently waited for thee, O Lord. My soul has waited patiently for thy word. My soul hath hoped in the Lord. The barren woman who in manner past hope beareth as fruit, O will and give birth to God in the flesh. Is made radiant with joy and dancing, rejoicing and crying aloud. Let all the tribes of Israel rejoice with me, for though I have conceived in my womb and put away the disgrace of barrenness, for thus hath the Creator been well pleased and hearkening unto my prayer in those things which I have desired. He hath healed the pain of my heart. From the morning watch until the night, from the morning watch, let Israel walk in the Lord. He who poured forth water from the dry stone, granted fruit to the womb of Anna, the ever virgin Theotokos, from whom the water of salvation will issue forth. No longer shalt thou remain on earth like fair in ground. Thou hast put away thy disgrace, for thou givest rise to the fertile ground, which will bear the grain of life, who taketh away the disgrace of all men. For he hath been well pleased in the loving kindness of his mercy, to form himself in what is in to him. For with the Lord there is mercy, and with him is plenteous redemption, and he shall redeem Israel out of all his iniquities. He who poured forth water from the dry stone, granted fruit 
Let us complete our evening prayer unto the Lord. Lord, have mercy. Help us, save us, have mercy on us, and keep us, O God, by thy grace. Lord, have mercy. That the holy name may be perfect, holy, peaceful, and sinless. Let us ask of the Lord. Grant this, O Lord. An angel of peace, a faithful guide, a guardian of our souls and bodies. Let us ask of the Lord. Grant this, O Lord. Pardon and remission of our sins and offenses. Let us ask of the Lord. Grant this, O Lord. Things good and profit, profitable for our souls and peace for the world, let us ask of the Lord. Grant this, O Lord. That we may complete the remaining time of our life in peace and repentance, let us ask of the Lord. Grant this, O Lord. A Christian in each our life, painless, blameless, peaceful, and a good defense before the dread judgment seat of Christ, let us ask. Grant this, O Lord. Calling to remembrance our most holy, most pure, most blessed, glorious Lady Theotokos and ever Virgin Mary with all the saints, let us commit ourselves and one another and all our life unto Christ our God. To thee, Lord, Lord. For good God art thou, and the lover of mankind, and unto thee we send up glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever unto the ages of ages. Amen. Peace be unto all, and to thy spirit. Let us bow our heads unto the Lord. Son of the Holy Spirit, now and ever unto the ages of ages. Conceive, or you will benefit all things 
wherefore that is called them blessed, and let us add with faith at their divine conception of the Mother who will give birth to our God, and through whom great mercy is richly given. Glory both now in the second tone. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Today the mystic flower, beginning to grow out of Jesse, the royal, the royal purple sprouted forth from the root of David, wherein Christ our God shall spring forth, saving our souls. Now let us thou thy servant depart in peace, O Master, according to thy word. For my eyes have seen thy salvation, which thou hast prepared for the face of all peoples, a light of revelation for the Gentiles, and the glory of thy people in Israel. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, and the ages of ages. Amen. O most holy Trinity, have mercy on us, O Lord, blot out our sins. O Master, pardon our iniquities, O Holy One, visit and heal our infirmities, for thy name's sake. What a mercy, what a mercy, what a mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, for <coughs> now and ever, and to the of ages. Amen. Our Father, who art in the heavens, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our debts as we forgive our debtors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from the evil one. Christ, the kingdom, and the power, and the glory of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto the age of salvation. Amen. Today the bonds of barrenness are loosed. For our kingdom to your kingdom God hath manifestly promised unto them that they would be on all expectation. Give birth to the divine maiden, from whom the infinite one himself becoming man shall be born. And he commanded the angels to cry to her, Rejoice, thou who art full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Have mercy on us, O God, according to thy great mercy, we pray thee, hearken and have mercy. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Now ye we pray for our great Lord and Father, His Holiness Patriarch, for real, for our Lord, the very most reverend, much fault in Alari, and first hierarch of the Russian Church of Rome, and all our brethren in Christ. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Now ye we pray for our all venerable Father, the Abbot of this Holy Monastery, our commemorate Seraphim, and all His brethren in Christ. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Again, we pray for this land, its authorities, and armed forces. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Again, we pray for the God preserved the Russian land and its Orthodox people, both in the homeland and in the diaspora, and for their salvation. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Again, we pray for the blessed and ever-memorable founders of this holy monastery, and for all our fathers and brethren gone to their rest before us, and the Orthodox here and everywhere laid to rest. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Again, we pray for mercy, life, peace, health, salvation, visitation, pardon and remission of the sins of the servants of God, the brethren of this holy monastery. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. More than all others, we have sinned against thee, and we have transgressed, O Master. And if we have not acquired repentance, instead of repentance, accept our offering. Thou having set thyself to mercy, as thou art almighty, free thy servants from the coronavirus. Groaning in pain, we pray thee quickly hearken and have mercy. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Look down, O Master, who loveth mankind upon the sacrificial labors of our medical workers. Send them steadfast health, strength, and fortitude of spirit, wisdom to accomplish their work for the good of our people, and bring about through them the healing of thy suffering servants. We earnestly pray thee quickly, hearken, and have mercy. 